Hey, this is Jet from JetSpencer.com and today I'm going to be doing my first movie review and I'm really excited. I am probably one of the most brutal critics in the history of man. Once again, there's not going to be any spoilers. I usually just go over the brief synopsis here. If you feel there's a better way I should be doing these videos, particularly the movie reviews, this is my first time doing this, just let me know. I'll change it up. You guys, once again, are the fucking heart and soul of everything that I'm doing here. Without you, without my viewers, without my subscribers, this would be fucking pointless. There'd be no reason for me to do this. At all. And the first movie that I'm going to be reviewing is Hail Caesar. And I was really, really excited for this movie. Super stoked and walked out completely deflated. Yeah, actually I went home and I, I found all of my history books that had Caesar in it and I burned them. I did, I burned them after watching this movie because I didn't want to think about anything um, Caesar related at all. It's from the Coen brothers actually. They have some you know fantastic hits already already. Um, you know, I'm a big fan of the Big Lebowski, so I got nothing against the Coens, but this movie just was all sizzle and no steak. And what do I mean by that? This movie has a star-studded cast. I mean, just, you just look at it, you're just like, oh my god, this is a movie? Yeah, just too much sizzle, aka stars, not enough steak, aka good quality content. You know, you would think, you throw George Clooney, you throw Channing Tatum, you throw Scarlett Johansson, you throw Josh Brolin, huh? you would think it'd be really good, but I, I was just massively disappointed. For a comedy, you would think I would laugh, and I didn't laugh once, not even a huh -huh. The movie revolves around Eddie Mannix and Baird Whitlock, uh, played by Josh Brolin and George Clooney, respectively, and basically the premise of the movie is that Eddie Mannix, he's going all around and he's making sure that the actors and the film uh, producers are getting along and he just he's doing all the managerial duties of what a manager of a film studio would be doing in the golden age of cinema. There was just all these convoluted storylines, there was never a climax. When the movie ended, I was seriously sitting there like, that's it? That's the end of the movie? Ugh. Massive, massive disappointment. So what am I leaving this movie with? How many stars do you ask? 1.5. Uh, sh just a shitty movie. I didn't like it. Maybe you will. Throw your comments on here. Let me know. Maybe I'm not seeing something. But I'm really standing by this. I mean, if I go into a film that's supposed to be a comedy and I don't even laugh one time, I'd say that's a failed comedy. Anyway, this is Jet from JetSpencer.com doing my first movie, you know, movie club, I don't even know what to call it, movie club thing. Yeah, that's, that's definitely going to be the name of it, movie club thing. No. You know what? You tell me. What should we call it? Movie club? Because, you know, got a book club, maybe do a movie club, movie reviews. Let me know what you think. Once again, this is Jet from JetSpencer.com. If you enjoyed the video or you hated it, make sure to like or dislike comment or subscribe and uh that's it hail caesar